What's up everyone, Tag Geek Josh here, and welcome to today's video. In today's video we will be unboxing the brand new LG Rizio 2 from Cricut Wireless. Now, if you may or may not know, the original Rizio looked very similar to these devices. This is the LG Leon, this is a Tribute 2. The Rizio, uh, the first Rizio basically looks exactly the same as these. But now, we get the Rizio 2 which improves on a lot of features which we will go ahead and take a look at so let's get to it it's a 4G LTE device right there um, what else here standard Cricut box go ahead and open it your plans or whatever on the left panel and here's the brand new Rizio 2 on the right some specs are 4G LTE Android operating system 5 inch HD display a 5 megapixel rear camera with a 2 megapixel front, 1.1 gigahertz quad core processor, a 2500 milliamp hour battery, which I believe to be is bigger than the original Rizio, and mobile hotspot capable. On the back, I'm very curious to find out or check this um, back cover out. That resembles the LG Aristo on Metro PCS, if you guys have heard of that device. If you haven't, go look it up. That's all I can say. How do we open this? Opens up like so. Usual cardboard piece. We have the usual Cricut manuals, activation guide, and your terms of conditions, terms and conditions of service, and your clear and simple quick start guide for the Rizio 2. And here's our battery right here, and this device takes a nano SIM card. See that? And here's your um, wall adapter here. This is a white version. I have like two of these, but they're in black. I don't know if I'm going to use this one. And here's your white uh, USB cable, standard stuff. No special anything, as far as I know. Let's take out the phone. Set this to the side. Let's go ahead and put in or put all the manuals back right quick. Give you something to look at while I'm taking out the battery. Two thousand five hundred million of hours. Very decent size for a phone like this. Let's pop out our SIM card. Like so. Very, very small. Here's the Rizio 2. This thing is actually very thin. But it's not as thin as the Tribute HD. I can tell you that. I highly doubt that's a fingerprint scanner, but we'll have to explore that. Let's go ahead and pop off the back cover. Go ahead and insert our tiny, tiny SIM card. Right quick like. Okay. While I'm back here, let's cover up those numbers. Your SIM card slot is right there, and on top of that is your micro SD card slot to clear things up. Alright, as I drop it, this thing seems rather slippery. Before we power it on, let's take a look around the LG Rizio 2. Up here, you have your front facing camera and your um, earpiece, that 5 inch display, on screen buttons, back home and recent apps, LG branding, 
uh, volume rockers on the left side which is a little weird because if you look at these devices you see all the main controls are on the back and the volume rockers are on the left of the uh, Rizzo 2 so that's quite odd on the right side we have nothing apart from the place to pop off the back cover on the bottom we get your micro USB charging port in the center off to the right uh, microphone and strange enough or strangely enough the headphone jack is at the bottom with this one and on the back we get your 5 megapixel camera LED flash in the center and your power button your cricket branding LG branding and your round speaker let's go ahead and take off the screen protector excuse my hands there we go so first appearance of the Rizzo 2 it looks very very elegant and very classy you can see that it's probably never gonna look this shiny again but I don't know if you can also tell but it has this very nice um, chrome um, bezel around it to give it a really nice um, look so anyway let's power it on is it weird that this device reminds me of the HTC 10 could be patiently waiting for it to turn on and once it turns on I will be back when I have fully set this device up silence But overall feeling in the hand is actually very nice. Feels very thin and very slippery. This is not a rubberized texture by the way. It's very slippery and glossy. Android is starting optimizing app one of one. No matter what camera that I use, by the way, this area, my closet here, is always gonna turn red. My hands are always gonna like turn this red color so I can't really do anything about that and this background is actually a white paper like I normally use for my comparisons but I just got this today just so you know alright so I'll see you when I have fully set this thing up alright so I am back and now the LG Rizzo 2 is all set up and ready to rock and roll so here's the LG Rizzo's home screen which actually if you look really close screen is actually very nice of course you can and will see some pixelation if you get up too close the overall performance as of right the second is very snappy and as you can see this is the home screen without the app drawer and I'm presuming you can go into settings and you can like download the uh, home screen with the app drawer in terms of apps you get the usual uh, Cricut apps my Cricut and Cricut visual voicemail and you get this app called Deezer and full screen but I don't think these are actual apps because I think they just take you to like the Play Store but it looks like this is an actual app so anyway the um, full screen app um, takes you to the Play Store to um, download the app or as you saw there update open so there's that but yeah that's is pretty much all I don't know if you noticed but the Play Store icon did update so that's very cool drop down notification shade it looks like it's uh, marshmallow so uh, I thought you can pull down anywhere to do it to um, bring it down basic um, toggles capture plus Wi-Fi sound Bluetooth rotation rotation data location flashlight airplane and sync I'm presuming you can edit these. I'm correct. You can add and remove these if you like. Let's go ahead and head over to the settings and see what kind of Android version we are running. 
I'm presuming, um, since this is a new phone, probably nougat, but at this point I'm guessing it's a lot, um, marshmallow, but we'll see right now. I'm correct, it's marshmallow, 6.0.1. Now who knows if this phone is able to get nougat, because it's literally brand new and I thought it would come with nougat, but apparently not, it's Android marshmallow. It's very interesting. In terms of storage, we get a massive gain here. We go from like 8 gigabytes from the original Rizio 2 a full 16 gigabytes with the Rizio 2, so that's a very nice bump up from the original Rizio. And apparently out of that 16 gigabytes, we only have a mediocre 9.33 gigabytes available. So that's quite sad, but you know, if you're like me, you don't download a whole lot of apps, you should be fine. It does have that double tap on, or double tap off and on, you can see there. Works, as you can see it takes like two, it takes like twice to actually get it turned on. Don't know if you saw that, but that app just flashed on there. I don't know what it's doing right now. Maybe that's because it's a Cricut phone. It's installing, it's installing some apps from Cricut. That's, that's how it was with um, previous uh, Cricut phones. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed my unboxing and first look of the LG Rizio 2. And I'll see you again in the next one.